What is up everybody, Mr. Fursman here, back with our first video in a very long time. So normally on this channel we do beard competitions videos. We haven't been able to do them during COVID because there weren't any competitions, they were all virtual, but not really in person. Well, about a year or so ago, beard competitions started coming back. We've been to a few, I've done a few videos that aren't ready yet, but those will be ready soon. Today, however, we're doing a beard oil review. I'm reviewing Big Sexy Beard Brands Beard Oil. So the backstory of this oil, uh, back in April, we were at the Desert Beard Battle in Arizona. And I placed third in my category, 12 over, you know, not too bad. And in the prize pack, we got this uh, big sexy beard brand oil. You know, I get a lot of oil in, in prize packs. As you can see, I have a lot of oil. I barely ever buy anything, honestly, uh, because I get so much of it. And you know, I've never really thought about doing a beard oil review before, but this stuff, let me tell you, I placed an order immediately. This stuff is so good. So, I'm not actually being paid at all. Uh, this stuff's so good, I bought a second bottle, and they hooked me up with a, a third and a fourth bottle. So I thought, you know what? I'm gonna review this stuff. Uh, something different for the channel. Uh, so let me know what you think. I don't know how it's gonna look, how it's gonna sound. And I've actually never even tried this. You can see the seal is still on it. So let's pop it open right now, shall we? And see what we got. Where is the seal here? There we go. So this is truly my first exposure to this scent. This scent is Ghost Stories. It is a Cuban tobacco and peppermint mix. They are, um, I guess the best way to say it is their scents are very unique for uh, for beard oil. You get a lot of the same same kind of similar scents when you when you you know go on beard oil companies. Big Sexy's uh, scents are very different and they're very they're, it's very refreshing. I like it. So this is the ghost story. It's my first time smelling. Let's see how it looks. Okay. That is very interesting. So this is the Ghost Stories Cuban Tobacco and Peppermint. So let's see how it's, it, it feels. Now I just got out of the shower. I have not uh, done anything except brush the beard. So we'll see how it goes. Now, if you've never put beer oil on before, use a little dropper. I usually do about five or so drops. My beard's about 18 inches long. Um, that's kind of a good balance. When I get out of the shower, I let it dry, I brush it out a little bit, five or so drops. It can be more or less depending on the thickness of your beard. My beard's pretty thick. So let's see how it goes. So you just put it in, you can see there, one, two, three, four, five. Usually about the, about the size of a dime, maybe about a pea's worth or so. I gotta say on first sniff, it's very interesting. Now one thing that struck me when I had the last one uh, was the texture. So a lot of time beard oils are either way too slimy or way too oily and greasy. And it can really uh, affect kind of how it feels on your face. If it's too heavy, if it's too slick, it'll bother you through the day. Uh, theirs was very uh, kind of relaxing. I will say you can definitely smell this one. You can definitely smell the tobacco in there. And the mint is not overpowering. It's definitely there. There's definitely some peppermint, but it's, it's more of a hint of peppermint versus like, a, I've had a lot of beard oils that, that are very minty and it's like you crush up an Altoid in your face. No, this is nice. Okay. Now, the first thing I do after I kind of brush in my beard, put it on with my hands, you want to get one of these, a Boar's Bristle brush. You can get these at Sally's. Mine's kind of messy. Ignore the hairs on there. Uh, you can get these at Sally's for 10 bucks or so. Uh, these are great for distributing the oil in your beard, making sure that you get it even all the way through. It also is a good all-purpose brush. It doesn't really damage your beard too much. And, uh, well. So on first kind of a application, I definitely say I'm, this is another winner. So the first one I tried was uh, just their Big Sexy, I think it was. And that one was really good. I got that one as part of my, my gift for getting third place. And I had to go on and buy some more and I have four total here, so yeah, good job, Big Sexy. Yeah, Sean and Corey over there at Big Sexy do a killer job on their oils. Uh, I don't see that lately. As you can see, I got oils. I, I I never think to do reviews, but man, they have gotten a customer out of me, that's for sure. So uh, yeah, I will review the rest uh, later here as I put this away. I have also. I have the legendary uh, scent. I have Honky Tonk Select. Those I have not tried yet, so I will try those in our next videos. Um, but yeah, 
Pretty cool. Let me know in the comments if you see if you think of any beard oils I should review. Uh, if you see any on this shelf, maybe I should review. Some of these are actually some of these are empty bottles that I've actually used. The Scullies and uh, and uh, what else do I have? A beard in Oregon. I've got some Honest Amish. Uh, I actually want to review. I got a bottle of the Honest Amish Premium that I actually might have to throw a review of. So that's pretty good as well. So yeah. Uh, Stay tuned to the channel, like, comment, and subscribe. We have a lot more, uh, well, a lot more beard oil videos coming soon. We also have more beard competitions. So we have our Sacramento video, which actually was recorded in July of last year. I'm finally getting around to finishing that one up. Uh, we've got our Beards by the Bay, uh, which was north of San Francisco. Uh, we have the Desert Beard Battle, which I mentioned before, which is a big, huge, awesome one in Arizona. We had a blast there. Mrs. Fersman was the judge. And then we just got back from Reno for the Best of the West Beard Festival. Kind of a small, really, really cool, fun uh, beard competition. So we'll have many more, so stay tuned. Firstmans have a lot of great beard content for you coming soon. Firstman out.